like even i sometimes just be like why do i need a puzzle with me that but <laughs> hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel it's your girl precious and i'm back again with another video and today <laughs> guys today i'm excited okay before we get into today's video if it's your first time here please please subscribe join the fam i'm a medical student i'm a final year medical student doing my internship currently in zambia and if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much so for today's video guys <laughs> So this has been my dream basically like having just a little man state a little man um let uh, stethoscope and it finally came in i ordered one it's like two months ago <laughs> but it finally came in if you're going to do your rotations i just want to show you guys some of the items that you guys would need or would like would really benefit you guys on the word yeah so some of the things i bought them already seen them if you watch my shorts i think i did a what's in my med school bag if you haven't watched it just look at my shorts and you should see what i carry my med school bag or in my back to the hospital but yeah one of the things that i would really advise some of these are most of the things that you need on the ward as a student some it's just yeah <laughs> some of the things that i wish i had on this video like was like um i ordered with the stethoscope i also ordered a surgical kit but it has not come in i think something happened and it hasn't come in but that's one of the things that i would have talked about and also unbox but it's not here so we're going to unbox the lead man yeah we're going to unbox a little man uh, a lead man stethoscope so yeah guys so this is the box yeah this is the box and yeah let's unbox it let, let us let's unbox it so So this is it. It's really pretty, guys. It's really, <laughs> it's really pretty. So it's got a little booklet and everything. I'm sure with instructions and everything. And then it's got like a spare, like some spare parts. Yeah, so it's got like some spare parts inside. And then this is the stethoscope, guys. My dream. She's finally here she is finally here we're gonna do some great things together guys <laughs> ah this has been whoo, like this has been my dream but anyway i'm sure you're tired of hearing that by now so heavy i'm about to i'm about to send my own heart sound so guys yeah this is definitely something you need on the world which is a stethoscope so when you're rotating on the world some things that you actually need and also be helpful of course number one is stethoscope you need your stethoscope and then another one is a pen torch so this is my pen torch just when you're doing examination and all and then another thing that is really like you really need on the world like you need in your pockets and all the time when you're carrying is a patella hammer like yes for your exams again you need a patella hammer and then another one which is really helpful to have i feel like few students have this but it's very important and like even i sometimes just be like why do i need the pulse oximeter but <laughs> a pulse oximeter is really important very very important to have in your pocket so this is one of the things that you can buy if you are going to such rotations and then another thing okay so for this one i tried to look for that I, I tried to look for an adult one like a normal a4 but i couldn't find i think this is an a3 so it's really big and then it's got snow white it's like for kids but then it was what i found available at the time when i started my rotations but yeah this really helps when you are like it's a clipboard so you put in your plain papers so this really helps when you're clicking patients on the word like it's really helpful like sometimes you need the support and it just helps like keeping your papers together also keeping your histories if you write your history on plain papers this is a very good help like it helps it's a great help and last but not least um is a handbook this one is not a must because you can have an online one but i physically have like i ended up just physically getting a, a handbook because i really and it's really helpful in the word sometimes the network in the hospital is really bad so the handbook becomes your second option because especially this time when i've been rotating you have doctors who will tell you like just google google <laughs> so, so having if the network is bad having a book has really helped but yeah those are basically some of the things that i would advise you to get if you are rotating or 
going into your final year another thing that i really wanted was a surgical um kit mainly because i did my classes online so i never got to really practice to do like to do stitches so i would not want to go and do that straight on a person so i wanted to try it first on something else and i ordered a surgical kit but it's not yet here so maybe when it comes i'll show you guys i'm not so sure and yeah and of course the other things that you need scrubs you need a pair of scrubs I don't have any right now, but like with me, but yeah, you need a pair of scrubs and them, a lot of affordable places you can get those in Osaka if you are in Osaka. And another thing that you also need is a lab coat. That one basically, like that's your passport to enter the hospital is a lab coat. Because <laughs> you're not wearing a lab coat, then we don't know who you are or yeah, if you're actually even supposed to be in the hospital or hanging around patients would so probably assume that you're either a patient or a visitor. But those are basically some of the things that you can get if you're going into your final year but yeah um i hope this video was helpful i hope you enjoyed of unboxing my lipman classic thriller um stethoscope with me but i hope you guys um i hope you enjoyed this video and if there's any other videos you guys would like to see please please request someone i know they requested a video um kondwani yes kondwani requested a video talking about how not to forget stuff when you're studying in medical school so i would actually like to do that as a collab with someone but i'm still working on it so definitely you will see some of those videos coming but just you see that video coming but just not now and yeah so if there are any other videos which you guys would like to see for me please feel free to comment down below in this in the comment section and i'll see you guys in the next video thank you so much for watching and bye guys <laughs>